Hi, everyone. Good afternoon and welcome to our CPS Energy Supply Chain Facebook Live event. Uh, my name is Rick Urrutia, and on behalf of CPS Energy and our supply chain team, we are super excited to be here today and share some helpful information. Uh, last month, we had an informative discussion with, with our Chief Administrative and Business Development Officer, Frank Almarez, and we also discuss how to become a supplier for CPS Energy, and we discuss current and future bid opportunities. Today, we're going to go through our current bid opportunities and upcoming bid opportunities again, but I'm also very excited to announce that today we're going to have some special guests that will talk to you about our energy to business, otherwise known as our E2B program, rebates and other program initiatives. Uh, this discussion will be uh, very helpful to, to businesses and, and will help them to learn how to partner up with CPS Energy and also uh, how to save your business some money. So thanks again for being here today. Really excited for uh, today's uh, discussion. And so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, I'd like to welcome Julia Martinez and Justin Chamberlain. They're going to, uh, they're our special guests today. So Julia, why don't you take it from here? Thank you, Rick. Hello, my name is Julia Martinez and I'm with CPS Energy representing our energy to business team. First of all, thank you for joining us today. So it'll be my pleasure to introduce to you our new energy to business team today to let you know about how CPS Energy continues to support you during the COVID-19 and speak to you about rebates and programs designed for small businesses, as well as highlight today small businesses who have participated in our rebates and their success stories. I will also uh, turn the mic over to my coworker, Justin Chamberlain, to speak to you about our STEP program and our new vision of STEP. I am happy to introduce our energy to business department, who is a mobile unit reaching out to our small business customers virtually, in person, and by telephone. Our goal is to provide you another added avenue of contact at CPS Energy. We will address complex issues, billing, or new construction questions. And most importantly, we will bring awareness of available products and services your business can participate in. You can contact Energy to Business at 210-353-6322 or email us at e2b at cpsenergy.com. Our commercial call line center is available for the day-to-day -day operations and continues to be open Monday through Friday from 7.30 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. CPS Energy continues to serve our community by implementing safety measures to ensure you have reliable power for your business. We have enhanced our safety measures by checking temperatures of our employees before entering our buildings. We have also adjusted our walk-in business center location hours to prepare the facility before the beginning of each business day and now are open from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Our energy advisors are working from home and our call center hours are available for you to continue to do business with us as usual. Working from home allows us to provide a greater physical distance in place as we follow CDC guidelines and use face masks if at any time we must enter our buildings or conduct business within our community. With this in mind, we have a campaign of outreach phone calls. If you see the CPS Energy phone number calling you, this could be an energy advisor reaching out to you to offer payment arrangements and discuss how we can assist you during these difficult times. We have seen an increase of fraudulent calls, so we want to share with you that CPS Energy will never call to collect for you over the phone. We're not disconnecting, but in fact, CPS Energy is actively sharing that if you contact us to make a payment plan to address these balances, we are removing late fees and that may have been charged into your account as a courtesy to further assist you with your financial needs. As mentioned, you um, to you, Energy to Business brings awareness to customers of rebates for your business and you can take advantage of these. 
you can visit a local retailer and purchase a Wi-Fi compatible thermostat and install it in your business yourself. Once installed, you can visit CPS Energy website to enroll your thermostat in our rewards program and be eligible for an $85 purchase rebate as well as a $30 yearly rebate. For more details on this program and incentive, visit cpsenergy.com to participate. These are several solar program options of your business is eligible for. Big Sun Community Solar is one of them. So we encourage you to visit our website and decide which program works for your business. In addition to having access to mow down smog, rebates, as well as the Small Business Solution Initiatives. There are many rebates listed for you to consider for both your residential and commercial accounts. So visit cpsenergy.com backslash save now to review the details or call the rebates department at 210-353-2728. There are many rebates to participate in, but today I want to highlight one that is free. That's correct, you heard free. We have partnered with Trade Allies to provide you a free HVAC AC tune-up. This will allow your central system to perform at its full potential. The details of what we will do during the visit can be discussed with our Trade Allies as each unit will call for different needs. To help determine your eligibility, contact our rebates department for further assistance at 210-353-2728. Keep in mind this rebate can be worth $175 to up to $1,800. This is dependent on the tons of your HVAC system. Some items addressed during this visit are measure and correct indoor airflow, as well as inspect and change the filter and adjust the refrigerant. This rebate is available for commercial accounts only and the customer must have not received the tune-up within the past five years. Today, I want to share how two of our small business customers who have participated in the Small Business Solutions Program by replacing their lights are enjoying their savings. A trade ally of CPS Energy can approach your business to offer their services in order to provide you the rebate details. These customers were provided a quote of their out-of-pocket expense and the rebate they would be eligible for if they replaced their current lighting with LED lighting. Budget Rent-A-Car, for example, continues to provide a service to the community safely, implementing their safety protocols and following all CDC guidelines. Their project cost was $26,851, of which CPS Energy provided an incentive of $16,110. Prior to the installation of their uh, installation of their LED lighting, their average utility bill was about $2,873 per month. But after the installation, they're now averaging about $2,061 per month. Our other small business is Mariano's Restaurant, located at 1609 West Avenue. His restaurant also replaced the building's lighting with a project cost of $508 of which CPS Energy covered $247. The bill was averaging prior to the lighting replacement $392. After the installation, it's now averaging $334 per month. Both customers received their Energy Efficiency Champion decal, which they proudly display to their customers to bring awareness that they are doing their part to reduce consumption in our community. Maybe next time your business can be highlighted as well as we share with our audience what you've done to lower your consumption. Thank you for your time. I will now turn the mic over to Justin Chamberlain who will be addressing our first vision of Save for Tomorrow Energy Plan and our new vision. Justin. Hey, thank you, Julia. And great work for you and your team working with these small businesses. And that's really what our Save for Tomorrow or STEP program was designed to do. STEP was designed to help our customers and our community save energy. We launched that back in 2009 with the goal of investing $849 million in our customers to reduce 771 megawatts by 2020. We grew this program uh, through increased community participation and things like energy efficiency, solar, our thermostat programs, weatherization, and a number of other programs. 
and we're happy to say with the support of our customers, we were able to exceed that goal. We actually saved 845 megawatts, that's 74 megawatts over goal, and we we're actually able to reset a year early and be able to reach that goal $126 million under budget. Now, the SEP program has brought tremendous value to our customers in energy savings, but it's also helped us in reducing emissions. The SEP program helped reduce more than 3.3 million tons of CO2, and it's also been able to support jobs. It's estimated that the SEP program supported 680 uh, annual jobs. Now we're at a point where we're reinventing our SEP program, and we're taking these past successes and combining them with the forward-looking vision of the flexible path to create what we call FlexStep. FlexStep is focused on balancing the tried and true with the innovative and new, allowing us to create new energy-saving programs and support the adoption of new technology. What's important, though, is we want to hear from you on FlexStep. If you haven't had a chance to go to our website and take the FlexStep survey, I'd encourage you to do so. Visit cpsenergy.com to help provide us that feedback. Now, if you haven't participated in our STEP program, it's not too late. Julia mentioned a number of great rebates that we offer, one particular being the small business solutions. We offer higher incentives for upgrading your lighting and your HVAC equipment. We also offer other great rebates too. Julia also mentioned our Wi-Fi thermostat rewards program. Uh, this qualifies for both your home and your business. If you upgrade an old thermostat with a new Wi-Fi enabled thermostat, uh, you can receive an incentive for that one. Uh, in addition to our solar rooftop rebates, we also have an innovative program called Big Sun Community Solar, which allows you to purchase solar without putting the panels on your roof. Big Sun is hosts and maintains the panels for you, and so if you move, the, so the solar goes with you, plus no holes in your roof, and you receive the benefit on your bill and also the tax credit. Now, these rebates offered through SEP just don't apply to small businesses. They also apply to your home, too. We have rebates for replacing your HVAC equipment, adding insulation, and we even have a rebate for your roof if you replace it with a cool roof. Lastly, for qualifying customers, we have a very robust weatherization program called Cost Averting. For more information on our programs and our rebates, I'd encourage you to visit cpsenergy.com slash save now or give us a call at 210-353-2728. And with that, I thank you for your time, and I'll turn it back to you, Rick. Hey, thank you, Julia and Justin, for those uh, that, that great information. Uh, it's always impressive to uh, rehear and learn about the things that uh, we are doing to help small businesses, all of our customers, and, and, and also our environment. So, so thank you for, for that information and those updates. Uh, next, uh, we're going to hear from Alyssa Ramos. Uh, she's with our supplier de uh, development group, and she's gonna talk about our current bid opportunities and upcoming opportunities. Alyssa. Thank you, Rick. Um, good afternoon, I'm Alyssa Ramos. I'm the supplier development coordinator with supply chain at CPS Energy. Um, so just really quickly, we're going to go over our bid opportunities and how to get to our bid opportunity page. So our website is cpsenergy.com. Um, to get to the bid opportunities, you would go to the header where it says work with us at the top. Um, you would click on the procurement and supplier bids and then go to the bid opportunities tab. Um, if you scroll down on the bid opportunities page, so just to highlight a few of the upcoming things we have, um, we do have our system protection engineering services that is due on October 29th. Um, we have our operational technology and supervisory control and data acquisition assessment, which would be due on October 30th. And then a few that we have due on November 4th, we have our supply and delivery of 27 and 10 kV riser pull metal oxidite surge arresters, supply and delivery of 175V and 27 kV surge arresters, and supply and delivery of various anchors. Um, so those are just a few that we have that are coming up in early November. Um, if you ever want to visit our bid opportunities page, um, it's on our website, cpsenergy.com. 
and below are some other things that were that are coming up in later November if you want to visit our page. Um, I'm also going to go over some upcoming opportunities that we have um, later in the month that we are that are coming up. So for our services opportunities, we have equipment rentals, line control, house construction services, on-site security and security consulting services, security equipment supply and installation, water well maintenance services, environmental permitting consulting services, mobile crane and boom services, vehicle brake parts and repair services, traffic and security officer services, street light poles and cable installation services, facilitator services for an upcoming rate advisory committee, the transmission line installation services and engineering services for transmission planning. Um, for our commodity purchases, we have MRO conduits and fittings, including various types of materials that would include terminal kits, spacers, plugs, splice kits, conduit and pipe straps, various size PVC and HDPE conduit, standard couplings and compression coupling, connectors, PVC adapters, end caps for PVC conduit, heat shrink sleeves, HDPE low break and PVC elbows, standard bushings, Cooper compression sleeves and lugs, overline accessories such as capacitor bank switch, insulators, bracket arresters, surge arresters, anchors, and cutouts. For fleet, um, we would uh, various size trailers for machine shop equipment, CNC water jet machine, and for the power, power plants, duct burner gas flow control skids, rail, call, rail car wheels. Um, so that's the upcoming opportunities that we have right now. Um, if you have any questions on getting registered as a vendor with CPS Energy, you could always reach out to us at supplierdevelopment at cpsenergy.com. And I'll hand it back over to you, Rick. Thank you. Hey, thank you, Alyssa. Great job. And and I think as as everybody can tell, there's a lot of opportunity out there. So so please uh, visit our website and look at those bid opportunities. So um, I know everybody's real busy these days and uh, really uh, thank everyone for taking the time out of your busy day to to join us and listen in. Uh, we had a great time sharing this information and and uh, always ap appreciate uh, the time spent doing it. Um, hope you found this information uh, helpful and we do look look forward to doing business with 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 all you folks out there. If you have any questions, please email us at supplierdevelopment at cpsenergy.com. That's suppliervelopment at cpsenergy.com. Uh, we're glad to help uh, with any questions that anybody has about any of these opportunities or anything else. Uh, so please don't hesitate to contact us. Uh, so again, thanks uh, to everyone for your time today. Uh, be safe, and we'll see you next month. Thank you.